so I have a process now. It's much nicer and it's within the idea that the wines are different than turns. Kind of. Because the wines are slower, you have to do more to get the ball to move. So you have to do more work in order to break inertia, in order to set the ball, uh, the ball path. Um, so there does come a point of stability um, in, in the wine. So I'll stabilize, get the left side moving, and then still thinking opposing direction. And then once, once the first uh, wind is cast into a gear. So one, two, and then I bring my, my or right foot back or whatever it is. I relax the right side until it comes back over. I'm thinking stability here. When the ball gets over my face here, and then once it starts creeping over right side. I'm going to oppose the ball. My right side is going this way in order to get my left side incorporated into the throw. And, but as soon as, it get, as soon as I start creeping back this way, I'm thinking I'm rotating the left foot. Uh, how do I rotate to the left foot? We're going back into that opposing forces. So stability into the opposing forces. And then once it gets in, I haven't messed with it yet. But once it gets in the second wind, it's just a little bit sooner. So second wind comes around. Boom. Stability. Left side. And then as, as soon as this happens, as soon as this happens right here, then start turning. Because I'm, I'm getting ready to... Getting ready to throw there. Uh, and then once that happens, everything else should be fine. Um, I'm not going to think stability, this, this, when it gets into the turns, it's just too, I want it to be reactive. So if that's the case, uh, I want to preset the idea in the winds, and then once I get into the turns, it's just whatever.